All right, on the top of anybody's list of fantastic value scotch whiskeys, you've got to put Monkey Shoulder. It's not a single malt. It's not a blend. It's a blend of single malts. Important distinction here. It's basically Glenfiddich, Balvini, and Canenvi, the three fantastic, well-pedigreed single malt distilleries that William Grant owns. They stuck them all together, no age statement, and that's what monkey shoulder is. Uh, it refers to the shoulder condition you would get from having to turn the malt spades uh, when they used to do floor maltings. Anyway, long story short, you're basically getting three delicious single malts at the price of a blended scotch whiskey. So why would you ever pass up a monkey shoulder? One, you can smell the pedigree. It's got that malt sweetness. It's got a little bit of citrus in it. Uh, it's got a little touch of oak character and a little bit of vanilla as well. So it's kind of sweet and malty and citrusy all at the same time. Very similar in profile to Balvini. It doesn't have the apple note that typical Glenfiddich has, but it has some higher tone fruit notes in it as well. Let's take a sip. Very rich, very malty. You know, they advertise this because of the price as a blend to use with mixed drinks, but you absolutely don't have to do it. It's perfect to sip neat and it's 30 bucks a bottle. How could you go wrong?